India is a water stress country. It means that the annual per capita fresh water availability in India has dipped below 1700 cubic meters. We rank 132nd among all nations with respect to per capita water availability. So what do we do? There have been various initiatives in the past, but now reusing wastewater generated by cities, which has been adequately treated, is being seen as a new way of supplementing existing water supply. How can we do that? To understand that, we need to first clear some basics. How is the waste or excreta or fecal sludge in itself managed? How do we scale up the reuse of treated wastewater in India? First, reducing the gap between the wastewater that is getting generated and the wastewater that is getting treated. For this, infrastructure development and compliance is the need of the hour. The second important thing is that we need to mainstream the reuse of treated wastewater in smaller cities and ULBs also. And third, very important thing is mandated standard for reuse of treated wastewater. The sectoral reuse standard is the need of the R that needs to come up so that the plants, the treatment facilities are confident in reusing this treated water instead of following those stringent regulations and norms. Society must confirm the links between the excreta or sludge it produces, the pollution it causes and the opportunity it has to reuse and recycle that waste so that it becomes a resource. This is what Waste to Worth is all about. Center for Science and Environment, in collaboration with the National Mission for Clean Ganga, organized a national workshop bringing together experts and representatives from seven Indian states and various national institutions to discuss the current state of wastewater management in the country. The event highlighted examples from cities that have successfully transformed treated wastewater into a valuable resource, addressing modern urban water needs while reducing climate-induced water stress. Let's talk to some of the people behind the feet of work. The fact is the real incentive you have today is the fact that you don't have a choice. Today, with climate change, you will get more water in fewer number of rainy days. You're going to get more floods and then more prolonged droughts, which means your ability to be able to hold that water locally in your lakes and your ponds, in your rain, rainwater harvesting systems, your ability to take every drop of that sewage and turn it back into water is absolutely critical. Reuse of treated wastewater holds a great potential for the nation. As per the very, very preliminary estimates, assuming a population of urban population of 400 million, the quantum of wastewater which is being generated and is available for reuse comes out to be around 20 billion cubic meter. 20 BCM is almost 10 dams. So imagine 10 dams of water every year. How much quantum of water we have available? So this is the potential we have. And secondly, as in an, the climate changes are affecting us, the reuse of this water becomes all the more important for us to have a sustainable future. Tamil Nadu has been a pioneer, especially Chennai itself, Chennai Metro Water itself, in the, in the use of wastewater reuse. They have done these two big tertiary treated RO process plants where I was involved in it for close to five years in my earlier tenure in TWIC, where we led the team for design verification and project implementation. We did a big study about five years back where we broke the whole state into different water grids called about 56 grids. And it, this is recycle is closely imbibed and especially being in a very industrialized state, Tamil Nadu is going for, especially with treated wastewater, for really for the industrial usage and shortly taking cue from CSC reports and other things, they would actually go in for indirect portable reuse as well as for agricultural reuse as well. This Maharashtra is one of the progressive states and it's doing great uh, in terms of water reuse. Uh, 
सी फॉर एज फार एज महा महाराष्ट्र स्टेट पावर जनरेशन कंपनी लिमिटेड अवर वन थर्टी मेगा वन थर्टी एम एल डी सीवेज वाटर ट्रीटमेंट प्लांट वॉज कमीशन इन द इयर टू थाउजेंड एट एंड देन लैटर एंड टू हंड्रेड एम एल डी प्रोजेक्ट वॉज ऑल्सो कमीशन इन टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट वी हैव ऑल्सो कमीशन चंद्रपुर चंद्रपुर सुपर थर्मल पावर स्टेशन रियूज प्रोजेक्ट ऑफ फिफ्टी एम एल डी एंड अगेन थ्री मोर प्रोजेक्ट्स आर कमिंग अप वन इन भुसावल एंड अदर इन पारस एंड वन इन कोराडी सो दिस थिंग्स आर गोइंग ऑन इन द यूज ऑफ ट्रीटेड वाटर सो ह्यूज ऑपरचुनिटी एंड एज यू कैन सी आई एम वेरी एक्साइटेड बाय दिस बिकॉज आई सी दिस एज रियली अ ह्यूज लीडरशिप दैट वी आर प्रोवाइडिंग फॉर द एंटायर वर्ल्ड इंक्लूडिंग large parts of africa large parts of the world which are going to which are already struggling with cleaning the water with huge health impacts of it and today with the greater dangers of climate change so water need not be wasted if urban industrial wastewater is treated for reuse then water will not be lost our rivers and lakes will not be lost and as sunita narayan said turning every drop of used water into water for use again